player out there has shown they just work tirelessly. Well, they're going to have to go again for another half an hour. Both sides still with one substitution in the bank. But... Looks like it may well be Leicester who will finish the stronger. Knockout, he's got beyond Briggs, still going. Knockout goes to ground as Cassetti leads on him. Penalty! That is a massive decision! What a huge decision given by Michael Oliver! I'll tell you what, I'm not completely sure about this. I'm, I'm with Gianfranco Zola. I feel that Knockart is looking for this penalty. There might be some contact on him, but he's looking to go to ground. We'll get a better view here. He does brilliantly to get into the penalty area, but once he knocks it past Cassetti, there's a slight touch. To me, he throws himself to the ground, and that is a massive call for the referee. I felt he was probably going to book Knockart, but he's given a penalty, a massive call, and I'm not convinced he's got it right. Knockart, for me, is looking for it. Well, it's a season-defining call, nothing short of that. If Knockout, who won it, scores it, Leicester City go to Wembley, and it's the end for Watford. <laughs> knockout takes, Almunia saves, Knockout follows in, Almunia saves again! Absolutely astonishing, now here come Watford. Forestieri. Here's Hogg! Dine! Do not scratch your eyes! You are really seeing the most extraordinary finish here! It almost mirrors the final day! With the very last kick of this playoff semi-final, Troy Dini wins it for Watford and sends them to Wembley! Well, we talked about Troy Deeney being an influence in this game, and that is exactly what he has been. But to me, not justice has been done in terms of the penalty. I didn't feel it was a penalty, so knockout not scoring. I felt was right, but you talk about a team that just doesn't...